all it takes for Eve was for Eve to hear. To hear. And that all, that's all that was needed for the enemy to use our ears to corrupt our minds. He questions the actual instruction. And then he proceeds with the question, yeah, why? You know, that's that's a chain or that's a pattern of planting doubt in a person. You first question what you heard, and after question that, we question why do you think is the what is the reasoning behind it? So whatever information it is that you are entertaining um, will reflect in how you speak and the content of your speech. Because your mind is the engine of your being, whatever you think about drives what you do and ultimately who you become. The state of our hearts reflect who we are and this is because of what you have heard and your mind has internalized it which has convinced you that it is exactly who you are. Now you can hear because the sound is being made but really comprehend what that sound is about. Your mind takes the sound and interprets it. You do not speak that of which you have not heard and accept it. Stand and proclaim when what you have heard is the opposite of what you are believing or what you have been convicted of. Once I speak, that also triggers my ears to listen to what I am saying. It doesn't matter how you start, it's how you finish. No, in this case it matters. Amen. And once you've started, speak right.